M and K, M and K, simply get to make your day. We got good news every Saturday with M and K. Welcome everyone to today's Max Review TV edition. She's M, and he's K. And today we'll be reviewing. Carmichael Show. Now, The Carmichael Show is an NBC television program that was created by Gerard Carmichael, Ari Ketcher, and Nicholas Stoller. Now, throughout the series, we see a group of directors that consists of Mark Sandrowski, Michael Zinberg, Betsy Thomas, and Jerry Cohen. Now the cost of this show consists of Gerard Carmichael, who plays himself, and we have Maxine, who's played by the beautiful Miss Amber Stevens West, and she plays his girlfriend on the show. And then we have Joe Carmichael, who's the obstinate father figure, played by the brilliant David Allen Greer. We have Cynthia Carmichael, who's the spirited mother on the show, and she's played by the radiant Miss Loretta Devine. We have Bobby Carmichael. Now, Bobby is the brother with a big personality. And much like the actor who plays him, Little Real Howry. And of course, we have the amazing and talented Miss Tiffany Haddish, who plays Bobby's ex wife, Nikisha. Now, Gerard and his therapist-in-training girlfriend, Maxine, are intelligent and ambitious, and they're ready to take the next steps to beginning a fulfilling life together. Now, fun fact here, Joe and Cynthia Carmichael are actually the names of Gerard's parents in real life. Wow, no sex. Yeah. This pilot jumps right into the question. Do you live your life for yourself or do you live your life for others? Now in this episode, Gerard and his girlfriend Maxine, like you said, they're taking the next step and trying to build a better life for themselves by moving in together. At the same time, his brother Bobby and his ex-wife Nikisha are divorced but they're still living together. Now this may seem normal for some, but both Bobby and Gerard are afraid to tell their opinionated parents for the fear of being judged. So again, this poses the question, do you live your life for yourself or do you live your life for others? Now we see controversial themes like this throughout the first season of the Carmichael show. Mm -hmm. They deal with things like protesting, trying to eat healthier, gender, religion, and even guns. And in each one of the episodes, they always deal with multiple sides of those controversial issues. And that is why I think one of my favorite characters is Joe, the father, which is played by the talented David Allen Greer. Now he gives you a thought-provoking side to the story with a comedic twist. For instance, in the episode where Joe responds to something that Gerard said, he says, don't worry, the woman trapped inside of him will tell the man what to do. <laughs> I thought that was hilarious. That was funny. That was, I believe, on the fourth episode Absolutely. where we see Gerard, uh, Gerard mentoring a young boy. Mm -hmm. And in that episode, the, the young boy actually identifies as a girl. Mm -hmm. Now, this, of course, delves into the gender issue and more specifically the transgender subject mm -hmm. and still somehow makes it hilarious. Absolutely. And this is all thanks to the writing style of Gerard Carmichael as well as his writing team and the theatrical performances by actors like David Allen Greer. Now my favorite character is going to have to be Bobby Glorifin Carmichael. Mm. The comedic genius of Little Rel Howry definitely adds its own flair to the show. But let's not forget Loretta Devine, 
Amber Stevens West, as well as Tiffany Haddish, who definitely make this show worth the NAACP Image Award for Outstanding Comedy Series. Well, there you have it, folks. The first season to The Carmichael Show. Please join us next week for another Max Review. Please like, comment, subscribe, and please share this video. She's M. And he's K. And this has been a Max Review TV edition. Good news every Saturday with Amen.